Good morning, leaders. My name is Staff Sergeant Martin. I work at the United States Army Physical Fitness School, and today we're going to be going over band work. Uh, more importantly, we're going to be improving on our flexibility. So why is flexibility important? Flexibility correlates to our warrior tasks and battle drills, so it's our ability to get up and get down and maneuver obstacles. Some of the common injuries that we see are a direct correlation to someone's inability uh, to be flexible. So today we're going to be going over uh, two different types. So I have a band here. Uh, this is what I'm going to, be, going to be using for most of the video. And then for those of you that don't, that don't have a band, then I have a ratchet strap, strap here that I'll show you how to work with that. Uh, so first I'm going to show you for the ratchet strap strap and I'm going to work over to the band. So for both applications, we're going to take uh, our heel, place it directly inside the loop of the strap here. I'm going to cross from the, outs from the inside over to the outside and from the outside over to the inside, making an X just about the ball of the foot. And you can see here that it's wrapped around to about the Achilles portion of my ankle. At all times during this, we're going to keep our ankle in dorsiflexion, the opposite leg on the ground, and at all times try and keep our leg as straight as possible. And then we rotate back, allow our leg to come up, and you go as far as you can keep that leg perfectly straight with the dorsiflexion. So if you start to bend as you come up, then you're going to lower your leg down until it becomes perfectly straight. So everything I'm going to show you with the band, you can do with the ratchet strap. So for the band, same exact thing. We're going to take our ankle or our heel, place it inside the band, go from inside to outside, outside to inside, pull back, keep this resistance. Then we're going to take this and go over our head, behind our back and position it uh, just below the shoulder blades of the back. Then we're going to lay down. Thumbs are going to place on top of here for that added resistance. And we're going to keep dorsiflexion at all times, legs straight. Again, if you start to come up and your leg bends, lower your leg down until it becomes straight. And we're gonna hold this position for 15 seconds. After 15 seconds, we're going to push up on the bands here and press our leg down to the ground and allow it to come back up. When it comes back up, if you need to apply additional pull and pull towards your face on the straps. You can do that three times. After that, you're going to press out and away from you. And you're going to come over top of your opposite shoulder and hold this position for 15 seconds. Again, if your knee starts to bend, lower this down to where your leg is straight. Press out and down, having 15 seconds, and repeat that process three times. After you do that, then we're going to come down and cross our ankles, and then come back up to our near side shoulder. You're gonna hold this position for 15 seconds, just like before. Press down, cross our ankles, come back up over top of that near side shoulder. After we do this three times, then we'll press straight down come straight back up, and then we're going to flex at the knee, just the knee, so we're not going to drop the heel. We're going to flex at the knee and press straight up. We're going to do 15 presses. Now at all times, I'm looking up in this video uh, as I'm talking, but while you're doing this, make sure that your head is placed on the ground at all times. After you do 15 presses, then we're going to take our leg, rotate over to the side, both shoulders in contact with the ground at all times. And then from the bottom strap with our arm that's closest to it, we're going to pull up towards our head. Hold this for 15 seconds and then rotate over to the other side. Again, keeping your legs straight at all times. If you start to rotate over because you can't keep both shoulders on the ground, then raise your leg up to where you can keep both shoulders on the ground. Grab the bottom strap and pull up towards your head. Hold for 15 seconds, rotate to the other side, do that three times. Then after we do all of this, we're going to pull out from the strap. Now this is going to test uh, a lot of people's coordination, but you're going to 
keep that resistance on the strap. You're going to rotate your leg outwards. Keep that resistance and then rotate over to your stomach. Pull the strap over towards your opposite shoulder. Pull enough resistance to where your thigh comes up off the ground. And you're going to drive your thigh and try and extend your knee for about six seconds. And then relax as you relax, pull up more resistance. It's important with this that you don't rotate your hips. You want to keep your hips towards the ground and allow your hip to relax and allow your thigh to relax so your thigh comes up and you get a good thigh stretch. And that is it for the band stretch. Okay, leaders, so just remember that improving on our flexibility will also help us improve on our warrior tasks and battle groups. Be ready, stay active.